So where do I put this solo tape? Ah, there. This is Starlight. Our community needs a doctor. If you know surgery and how to make steam packs, we have a place for you. A clean bed awaits you. We have access to water, enough food, and our place is well defended. Please, come and see by yourself. We secured the area. There was only one possible response to prevent further attack from raiders. We killed them all in a wide area. Turns out, Marcy is quite dangerous with a pistol, and she hates raiders. She keeps calling them gunners for some reason though. It apparently helped other farms nearby. The Abernathys visited us with lots of potatoes and melons to thank us. We partied this night. It was fun. And I think their daughter has a thing for Sturgis. We built a workshop shack for the scavengers, even though Sturgis likes to work alone on a special project. I wonder what that is. The others try to repair and improve whatever we find. Our farm's still growing. It seems to attract wild animals, but we are strong enough to take care of them, and they provide meat. It's almost unfair to hunt this way. We also have a Brahmin. Those two edit cows eat a lot, but they also provide milk and fertilizer. And if it becomes a burden, it will provide meat as well. Charles, take care of it. So, our radio signal worked. Francis, our new doctor, arrived with a couple steam packs and said it can close wounds and no surgery. He mentioned some magazines that we can find mostly in pre-war hospitals and clinics. It's Massachusetts, surgery, something. He said he learned uh, what he knows from them and will improve if we can find some more. I'll have to take a look for them. Going south, we came across a farm run by Mr. Andes. They had a water quality problem. I first thought that robots don't really need water or food, but Preston reminded me that they could grow some for us. So why not? They said we needed to go to the water treatment plant and fix the pumps. That's where I first met what they called super mutants. They somehow remind me of a guy back at the army. Jason, a big guy. His skin was greenish. He said it was a virus. I hope I'll never catch it. The plant was well defended, but there's nothing a few snipers can take down if they're fast enough. And we now have a rocket launcher. That may help in further exploration and defending our village. Once the plant cleared, Sturgis explained us how to fix the pump, and so we did. The robot seemed happy with that, and allowed us to use the food they produce. Too bad we can't pipe the water to our place. We still need to assign someone to do the trip. It's not that far, but we need everyone on site for now. Sturgis thought about reprogramming those robots to work for us in Starlight but pre-war programmation is hard to hack. I heard about a big city. From what I understood, it's in the, the old baseball stadium. There might be some opportunities there. 